Let's have some more fun here. Uh, I'm gonna go through a minor progression with you, show you some new chords, and then I'm gonna show you how to put those natural minor scales on top of this progression to start creating melodies. All right, we're gonna start off with a B minor seventh chord. And it's gonna be a little bit different way of fingering it than we previously had worked on. I want you to put your second finger on the seventh fret of the sixth string, and then I want you to bar your third finger from the fourth string all the way down to the first. Now the fifth string is going to be deadened. The back of this second finger here is going to tilt down and just touch the fifth string. And that's going to come out deadened sound. That's the minor sev B minor seventh chord. And we're going to use a strumming pattern just down. Next chord is going to be an E minor seventh chord. It's going to be fretted with your first finger on the seventh fret of the fifth string, your second finger on the seventh fret of the third string, your fourth finger on the eighth fret of the second string, and your third finger on the seventh fret of the first string. The fourth string is going to be deadened with the back of the first finger in the same fashion as the other chord was. Dead. Same strumming pattern. Then the progression is going to go back to the B minor 7th chord again. Next we're going to go down to a G dominant 7th chord. First finger is borrowing across all 6 strings. Your third finger is on the 5th string, 5th fret. Your second finger is on the 3rd string, 4th fret. Just one time with that. And then we go down to an F sharp dominant seventh chord. It's just one fret down to the second fret, same chord. And the progression ends with the B minor seventh chord one more time. So let me show you the whole progression in a row now. All right, now I'm going to play it with a bass and drum backing track. Now after I play through it with the bass and drum backing track and you hear how the whole progression sounds together, I'm going to have it played again with the bass, drum, and rhythm guitar, and I'm going to play the natural minor scales we learned in the key of B over this, since this is a B minor progression, and show you how you can start creating melodies in lead lines. Here it is. <laughs> 